upcoming K-dramas for the first quarter, January to March 2024. A brand new year means brand new K-dramas, which includes the conclusions and part twos of some popular 2023 K-dramas. With sci-fi, historical, rom-com, noir, action, and mystery. Not to mention some incredible stars will be appearing on our screens. Number 1. Marry My Husband Adapted from the webtoon of the same name, Marry My Husband stars Park Min Young and Nan Wu. With a touch of fantasy, a time-altering romance, with a hint of comedy will be awaiting us, as our severely ill female lead will discover a shocking betrayal by her husband and her presumed close friend. Suffering an accidental death, she awakens in the past, now with an opportunity to change her fate and serve up revenge against those who broke her heart and will become connected with our main male lead, who happens to be her boss. But our male lead has a secret of his own, in addition to that strong admiration he feels towards our female lead. He's been bottling it up. Number 2. Love Song for Illusion also known as Fantasy Sonata, our leading couple consists of a king who depicts two sides and personalities. He'll find himself opposite our female lead, who is a skilled assassin, but who happens to be on a mission for his demise, but she'll end up falling for him instead. Our king secretly works as a talented fashion designer at a boutique. His other personality that surfaces is a smooth, charming guy who's able to draw others in. Action and intrigue await them both. This K-drama was also a webtoon adaptation with a historical setting. The drama stars Park Ji-hoon and Hong Ye-ji. Number 3, Death's Game, Part 2 Following up from the success of Part 1, Death's Game is back with the next installment when our male lead hits rock bottom after facing tremendous stressful life events from relationships to the loss of his life savings. He makes a drastic decision, however, Death does not take his actions lightly and instead punishes him. She evokes that he must live out 13 other lives, and if he survives death, he'll have a chance to live out their full lifetime. The thriller fantasy stars Song Guk and Park Seo Dam. This drama is also based on a hit webtoon. A variety of character portrayals await us, including that of a detective, a painter, a writer, a martial artist, and a model, while our Grim Reaper is our talented female lead. Number 4. Night Flower Also known as Flowers That Bloom at Night, Lee Hani and Lee Jung Won lead this historical K-drama, which has a touch of mystery and comedy. Our female lead is a widow and lives a prestigious noble life with her in-laws. She abides by tradition, but at night, she jumps over the wall and helps those in need. She'll soon cross paths with our male lead, who is a handsome senior officer. He happens to have the right expertise and skill for his line of work. As they become further involved, friendship and romance may spark between them. Number 5. A Shop for Killers Action, mystery, and thrills abound in a shop for killers. The drama is also known as The Killer's Shopping Mall. Our young female lead was raised by her uncle, but she one day gets notified that her uncle has suddenly passed away. This happens right after she enters college. He always seemed to have an air of mystery about him, and a sudden wave of action will shower her with bullets, and she must now fight for her own survival and try to uncover why assassins are coming after her. She'll use the unique training her uncle gave her to outwit and survive this bizarre set of events. The drama stars Lee dong wook and Kim Hye-joon in the leading roles. Number 6. The Bequeathed A mystery thriller is in store for us in The Bequeathed, which is the story of another female lead who suffers the loss of her uncle. She is also an heiress who discovers that she is now inherited 
a grave site, but the events surrounding it are even more mysterious, as her personal family history, or skeletons in the closet, so to speak, will begin to unravel. Kim Hyunju and Park Hee Soon star in this miniseries, which will give us an obsessive detective male lead. We'll also have a half-sibling connection in this 2024 drama. Number 7, Captivating the King, a captivating historical melodrama. Starring Jo Jung Suk and Shin Se Kyung, is set to air this 2024. Our male lead is a prince who is honorable and has a good relationship with his brother, the king. But a set of events and misunderstandings will sever their once close bond. Our male lead traveled outside the palace and met a beautiful and talented Baduk player. But she has a secret she's on a mission of revenge. Number 8. Flex Cop On Bo Hyun and Park Ji Hyun will flex their handsome visuals in Flex Cop. Our male lead is a third generation conglomerate, and with that wealthy background, he can obviously make things go his way. But he'll soon become entangled in a case, as he ends up working with a smooth talking detective. Our male lead may seem a little spoiled, where our female lead is a tough team leader. We'll get the day to day slice of life of a police work setting. Number 10, Queen of Divorce. A law and legal drama is coming up in Queen of Divorce, and that happens to be our female lead, having been betrayed by her husband in the past. And overcoming divorce herself, she strongly helps and offers solutions for those that find themselves in unfair divorce circumstances. Our male lead isn't exactly a puppy. He's cute, but he's known as the German Shepherd because of his strong sense of intuition and ethics. These two will work together, utilizing their personal experiences and knowledge of the law to help others. They'll also have their own strong connection forming as well. Our leads are Ijia and Kang Ki Young. Number 11, Branding in Song Sudong. Some people say YOLO, and our male lead once lived by that expression of you only live once. With a lot of enthusiasm and an attractive personality that also matches his looks, he suddenly starts an internship, but this leads to conflict with his boss, and they seem to be at constant odds. Our female lead is successful and the youngest marketing leader on the team. While she's also gained recognition as a legend in the industry, she'll get entangled with our male lead and things spiral upside down for her as an unplanned kiss has our leads souls swapping bodies in this business rom-com that has a supernatural twist viewers can expect an enemies to lovers scenario as the magic on sets and will be portrayed by kim ji Eun and lomon number 12 killer's paradox for some backstory, he's just a college student and a part-timer at a convenience store. One night, that accident with a patron results in a tragedy, but he realizes the person whose death he accidentally caused was a serial killer. Our male lead will then discover that he has the gift that allows him to sense the bad seeds among humanity. As a dark hero, he rises up against these evil people who commit unthinkable acts and he'll make them face his swift justice. But we'll have a cold-blooded and talented detective on the case and following not too far behind him. Killer's Paradox is based on the popular webtoon, also known as The Murderer and the Toy. Choi Woo-sik and Song Suk-ku star in Killer's Paradox. Number 13, Wedding Impossible. Jeon Jung Seo and Moon Sang Min star in this webtoon adapted rom com where our male lead, who happens to be gay, is also a chez Air, and our female lead, a hopeful actress, will soon find themselves in orchestrating a fake marriage. All while his younger bro will step in and try to shake things up between them, especially regarding their relationship. The drama brings us a hidden identity, along with a marriage of convenience. 
with only 12 episodes and produced by TVN. Viewers are looking forward to this Webtoon adaptation. Number 14, Chief Inspector, The Beginning. It's time to check back in on the main character, Park Young Han, before he gained his position as a chief inspector. Our story will take place in the 1960s, about a decade before the original drama, with a focus on work and slice of life at a police department and the relationship between co-workers. In this time period drama, we'll see celebrities, Lee Jae-hoon, and Lee Dong-hui. The original Chief Inspector investigative drama aired from 1971 to 1989 and has over 880 episodes during its run. But here, viewers will revisit nostalgic characters, and this will appeal to older and younger audiences. Number 15, Queen of Tears. A married couple is in conflict and have to face the odds stacked against them. Our leads have highly ranked positions, including that of a legal director for the conglomerate Queen's Group. Our female lead is an heiress of the Queen's Group department store, but she herself is known as the Queen. Our leads have a humorous love story, despite facing a marriage crisis. This melodrama is a business rom-com. Celebs to look out for in the leading roles include drama fan favorites Kim Soo-hyun, and Kim ji -won. Number 16, Parasite the Grey, with inspiration adapted from the sci-fi Japanese manga Parasite. In this K-drama, parasites rain down from space and infect human hosts by controlling their brain and ultimately survive and live inside their human host. In this drama, our female lead becomes infected. Her hand is claimed by the parasite, who fails to take control of her brain. The two have no choice but to accommodate one another. Our other lead is searching for his missing sister, and our other leading character is part of The Grey, an investigative team involved with the Parasitic Life team, doing their best to solve the horror behind the parasites. Parasite serves up action, suspense, and horror elements. Number 17, Player, Season 2. This pre-produced noir suspense drama is an action thriller appearing on our screen soon. We'll also get a well-scripted touch of comedy as our characters face some extraordinary circumstances. Our key players are from a variety of backgrounds and viewers can expect a well-assembled team which includes that of hackers, scammers, skilled fighters, and exceptional driving scenes by our female lead. As this group teams up to steal corrupt money that has been illegally gained, this network of questionable talents are organized by Song Song Hoon and Oh Yoon So. Number 18, The Crown Prince Has Disappeared, Suho and Hong Ye Ji will star as romantic love interests in a Joseon era set rom-com, which has some royal trouble on the way. Our female lead is set to become the wife of the Crown Prince, but a series of events has her kidnapping him instead. While on the run, the two will face a series of amusing moments, and romance will also begin to bloom between them, but not before a love triangle has formed. Bonus Mentions Wonderful World And that wraps our 2024 first quarter list. Which dramas are you looking forward to the most?